Rich, thanks for tuning in. Um, also, I just want to quick shout out to um, uh, Pete from over in the States uh, from uh, uh, DIY Auto School. Thanks, mate, for checking out the channel and uh, yeah, in the comments. Anyway, um, now I'm not doing any work actually today on the Ute just yet. I'm just waiting for some more clamps to turn up and post. Now, what I am doing is I've got this scrap over here and uh, that I've just cleaned the top off and that and uh, got the caster wheels. Now what I'm doing is I'm going to be making uh, I'll just walk over the ute. <coughs> now what I'm going to be doing is welding the casters onto that bottom section there so then I can bolt cup bolt this on about say there and that with the brace going across in the centre um, of it and that to um, be able to hold the back of the ute up um, for when I need to move because I'm ho having to move sh like I'm in ASAP but I still haven't been able to find a place um, and that so I just thought I'd do a quick video making this little stand up Morton all this together and yeah. So anyway, let's put it there.
No, don't recommend doing that all the time.
I've gone along and I've just for now I've uh, I've just drilled the top holes. Now there is another hole at the back there, it's around about here somewhere. And then I've got a little template that I made up for where the holes are roughly. So the whole the whole idea is to go along and uh, put this bracket in to to there. Um, and uh, yeah, so either put it in here or put it up a little bit further. I'm more inclined. I'm thinking I'm putting it down here, so then I can weld in a couple of uh, gussets um, in along here, and that, and maybe a couple up along the here for the extra strength. Um, like I've left about roughly at an inch clearance. And that, so when I do drop the car off the uh, the stands, then it's not too far to actually go. Um, I am looking at this. I'm actually going to work this design out, um, and that, and I may actually make a couple up, um, and that, and then I'll I might actually sell sell them, um, and that very hard to get a. Clear. Find a picture. Hang on, I'll stick it on an angle. And that, roughly like that, uh, with a couple of the gussets going in, and that along this part here where my boot is, and maybe a couple up there. Um, that should get, give me enough um, strength. And because I don't want it up too high because I don't want the legs to push out. Um, and that, so I thought if I put it down a little bit lower and that, then there's less chance of the um, legs spreading apart, especially when I've got the second bolt in at the top. So there's there'll be four bolts holding it there. Um, I may possibly go over and uh, maybe put another one section in here and weld it in with another gusset in, in here. That there's just extra support. We'll see how it goes. Um, and that, um, waiting in for my extra clamps to come in so I can look at doing a bit more of that side there. So, yeah, so, uh, gone along, I've cleaned up all the bottoms as well. Uh, just sprayed a little bit of black, um, edge primer over it for now. Um, and that to, uh, just coat it. Now, these are just cheap rubber casters. I just wanted something, oh, I couldn't afford um, brown and dollars for some decent metal ones so yeah um, <clears throat> if these ones break and they don't work then um, I'll go to the next stage and uh, yeah but if anyone has uh, two of those old school metal casters or some stronger ones yeah just shout out and let us know uh, if you can help us out that'd be good too so yeah that's it so far um, I'll uh, get on to the rest of it, and, uh, yeah. Alright, so stay tuned. Okay, uh, yeah, the battery's a bit low, but anyway, steam on. Um, what I've done is I've ran, no, I well, used a flat disc, and that just to clean it all off. But, <laughs> if you can see it, yeah, I had a gentleman this morning that's a follower on my Facebook page uh, just say to uh, just bevel the edge a little bit which will help give it more penetration uh, so I'm going to try it on the crossbar and that sort of stuff so yeah alright um, so we'll get on with it and I'll be back in a minute so yeah um, got along done there along the top bits there I'm going to go along and do the rest of these bits here and then because uh, the phone's almost flat I will uh, show you the finish and that once it's done. So, they're not the best, best of welding. They think there's a lot of focus.
So there's one. But yeah, I don't know, cheese. drilling the two other holes in now yeah, I haven't tightened it up too much just yet oh, but it's down as you can see the unit is down the rear is free to move around and that on that bracket um, now that bracket I made that up for under 100 bucks that's $68 for the caster wheels. They're only rubber ones, so they may not last, but it's only just to move it. Uh, I'll just jack it back up with the, the straps just to keep the weight off it uh, until I'm ready to move it. Um, and that sort of stuff. So, yeah, so that's that little project done. It's finished. Um, once again, go to your scrap yard on that and i will see what they got. You could make something like this up for the back. You could probably even make one up for the front. And that, um, as well, and bolt to the front bumper bar brackets. Uh, where you put bumper bar brackets go. Or if you've got the front end up, you can bolt it to where the front end bolts to so they move everything around. Uh, not really hard. You can have a uh, gas leak or a gas leak. That's a lot of use. Um, and that. So, yeah. Bye everyone, thanks for watching. Uh, stay tuned for the next one. Uh, don't forget, if you like the video, please like. Um, if you like the channel, subscribe, please. Uh, help us out, trying to get 4,000 subscribers. Um, and that, if possible. Um, so, yeah, so, uh, I'll get on to it, don't forget. If you have a sticker, please do. Payments can be made through PayPal. $5 each, or 2 for 7, and so, uh, 2, so, uh, 2 for 7, um, and that sort of stuff, pretty basic for us now. Hello everyone, hello thanks again, and uh, well, stay safe and keep your laptop down, yeah.